Hello everybody, this is Vertical Sandwich and welcome back to Let's Play Simpsons Hit and Run. So we changed our clothes, we're in the Lisa Cool costume and we are going to go back down to Chief Wiggum and we're going to help him get three strikes against Snake. Or Jailbird. Whatever you want to call him. We could call him Snailbird. Or... Jake. No. It's funny it works out that way, but... We won't be doing that. Not in this LP. No sir. I have my standards! Damn it. Alright. So, anyway. <laughs> we're headed down to the Monty Burns Casino. Which... I don't understand why they moved that when they moved the town. Oh, I can explain that. Implosion in 3, 2... You s Wait, implosion? Sorry, anyway. Ugh. Just, uh, just episode memories flooding back to me. Alright, so now all we have to do is get in Wingham's car. And the way that this mission will work is we have to stay on Snake's tail and pick up the three things he drops. That's it. He drives really, really, really fast, though. So. It's a little rough. But we can do it. Alright. Slithery sleuthing. See, so it's just follow Snake. See? So he's Jailbird sometimes, he's Snake. And he's gonna do what they do in all those follow missions. He's gonna run right past us and we gotta get right up on his tail. And... Well, he dropped that right away, so... These vary, too. Like, where he drops these things changes. So you just gotta, you know, try to take the path that he takes so when he drops stuff... But this is a really quick mission. I mean, this is going to be like the, the fastest mission ever. That's showing him what but, for. So, yeah, like, oh, it's nice you dropped that one on the stairs. Running over an elderly person without a license. Nice, running over an elderly person. That's fun. We've done that like a million times in this game. All right, and he's going to take the bridge. So, ooh, that was tricky of him. Okay, so now we got to go back to. Uh, to Mr. Burns' casino or whatever, so not a bad, not a bad mission. You know, it was all that much. Although we have a time limit on this, so we can't really dink around too much, but you know, I mean, like, this is, yeah, we've made this drive so many times now that so, I, I think that, oh no, we have a, there's two more missions after this, so we're not almost done with the level yet. But, I mean, I guess we're way closer than we were a couple videos ago, so that works. Don't be alarmed. I'm a professional. We need 20 Man. seconds left. We can make it. It's gonna be close. The good thing about the Monty Burns Casino, though, when that's your goal, is that you can just you can just go balls to the wall down this little thing, and the minute Man, you hit the ramp, it... three. there we go. All right. We got all we need on we this. Got all we got to your brother. put. I've seen lots of mysterious government types. Over nice. The docks. Uh, maybe they send him on a nice cruise. They got some great package deals these days. Five nice. Cafes per boat inclusive. Stupid Thanks, Wiggum. Chief, you are My God. After all. He's... Ah, you're just saying that. Yes, yeah. I am. Yes, she is. <laughs> At least she's honest. All right, so that's you know we're uh, we're making great progress here. Yep, we got five of seven. So good for us. Alright, so we've got to actually, um, we have an unrelated mission. So, we have to go find the sea captain. Am I old enough to drink and this is another, yet? this is another thing where what we're doing has nothing to do with anything. It's just, you know, and, and obviously that's got to be kind of part of the, part of what's going on. I mean, they can't, you know, not, although well, they could have crafted a story where everything was related. They could have, I mean, you know, these are all like... Simpsons writers are, are all like so, these Harvard educated guys and you know they could have come on they finished college they could have come up with a plot that made sense but whatever it's a video game I guess <laughs> enough of your high handed criticism vertical sandwich like let's see you write in a Simpsons episode I actually kind of wanted to write I I, God, I I wrote almost an entire screenplay um, I have just to finish the last couple pages of the screenplay I'm working on Believe it or not, maybe more about that later. But uh, it's a, it's a comedy action movie, which it won't sell at all. But it was fun to write. I mean, I had a blast writing it. I, I was shocked, actually. I was shocked at how quickly I got to like 80 pages. You know, it was just like, oh my god. All right, so we got to talk to the sea captain here, and uh, this is a weird mission. 
so th we'll be picking up fish, and there's a little bit of strategy in this, but really what you're going to gain most from this is watching me do it, because you'll see where everything is. Maybe I haven't. Render me a favor, and it might jar. Jar! What favor? I've got a shipment here of So this pirate walks into a bar and he's got this big steering column hanging out of his pants. I mean like shifter and steering wheel and everything and the bartender says, Hey, you've got a steering wheel hanging out of your pants and the pirate says, Arr, and it's driving me nuts. Alright. Anyway, so you gotta pick up these fish and you really gotta get a good shot at this right here. At, at going down here and running around here without falling off the dock. Like that will mess you up so bad if you do and and just the run through squid port here is a little tricky it's it's also a little hard to you know try not to hit too many people because you don't want to get a hit and run during this mission not that, that would kill you but um this mission if you if you do it perfectly right you're gonna end up with you know maybe 10 seconds left they don't give you enough time to do it you know where you can really mess up bad but, I mean, the route I, the route I take for this is the only possible route. I mean, it's set up so there's the only one route that can do all these fish. So. And then, you know, you just need to watch at the end, because at the end, they actually, um, they fake you out pretty bad. So. Is that, like, that's gotta be a Braveheart reference, right? Or just yelling like, freedom like that? Uh, not a big fan of Braveheart, actually. I mean, it was alright. You know, like, I, I don't know, I, that's just not my movie style, like, the kind of epic, you know, axe in your face kind of thing, I'm just, no. I guess it wasn't funny enough for me, that was my problem, is that it wasn't goofy enough, it was so, it took itself so seriously. But, whatever, anyway, um, alright, yeah, so, the, like, the, the tricky part about this is, is you go up the dam here, and you can kind of ride this edge here, I mean, that'll keep you out of traffic but then after this last one you have to take a right and make this jump and that's tricky because you can miss that really easily and, and now we have all the time in the world to get back to the sea captain so yeah whose name is McAllister apparently I think that's I think that that comes up in the 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 one where Homer goes to the all-you-can-eat buffet and ends up taking them to court because they kick him out um, I think it comes up like he's on the stand in Lionel Hutz. It, it, it calls him Captain McAllister. I think. I'm not. I can't swear to that. Alright. So we just gotta get down, and then we've, we've only got the, the level ending mission, which is another smash a car mission. Um, except in, in this one we'll only have to smash one car, but it's the toughest car we've ever had to smash. So... So yeah, so that's that's your that's your sneak preview, and it's a multi-part mission, but like in a kind of goofy way. So um, we probably won't fit it on this video, but whatever. All right, let's take the jump. Boom! Yeah. Alright, so he's just a... There's actually... I could have went down below and actually cut out this little turnaround here. But, what are you going to do? So we talked to the sea captain. Arr! me catch of the day. Now, I can tell ye, I saw your brother. Really? That's great! Oh, he saw our brother! He long black limo, and... Ahoy! There she drove. There she bl so this starts the next mission right away, and we're not, we can't, we can't do that with the car we have, so. We're going to have to cancel out of this and stuff, so we'll do that, and we'll get um, a, v a good smashing vehicle. And uh, and then I'm going to cut it off, and I'll talk to you, you know, next time or whatever. But we'll start right from here, I mean, it's not, th there won't be a break for me, there's going to be a break for you. Because we're almost at 10 minutes, and this mission's going to, I mean, this mission in transition to the next level is going to take longer than that. So yeah, so we're just gonna cancel out of this mission and get a new car, and then we'll restart the mission. As convoluted and crazy as it is. So you guys, you take care. Thank well, you for watching. Home, Talk to you next time. Hitchhiking.